Looking for a classic movie that blends humor, surprises, and a touch of melancholy? Look no further than The Palm Beach Story. Released in 1942, this film delivers a delightful mix of funny, shocking, and sad moments that will keep you entertained throughout. Wondering if anyone has a cherished memory associated with this movie or which role was their favorite? Stay tuned, as we've got plenty of interesting facts coming up. We'd also love to hear your stories and memories related to this movie, so feel free to share them in the comments below. Keep watching to discover more about this timeless gem. Get ready for a roller coaster of emotions. In 1942, the Palm Beach story hit the silver screen, captivating audiences with its wit and charm. Set in the glamorous era of the 1940s, this movie takes us on a hilarious journey through love, money, and mistaken identities. Directed by Preston Sturges, it's a classic example of screwball comedy, a genre known for its fast-paced dialogue and zany situations. The Palm Beach story follows the escapades of Jerry and Tom Jeffers, a married couple facing financial woes. Determined to solve their problems, Jerry embarks on a journey to Palm Beach, Florida, where she encounters a series of eccentric characters and finds herself entangled in a web of romantic entanglements. As the plot unfolds, viewers are treated to a delightful blend of humor, romance, and social commentary. This movie is significant not only for its entertainment value, but also for its reflection of the cultural and social dynamics of its time. Against the backdrop of World War II, the Palm Beach story offers a lighthearted escape, providing audiences with laughter and joy during a tumultuous period in history. In the realm of classic cinema, there lies a fascinating tale of cinematic ingenuity. Within a notable film, a unique scene unfolds during a wedding where twins are portrayed by the same actress, lending an air of mystery to the visual effects employed. This clever maneuver, achieved without modern technology, remains a point of wonder for enthusiasts and movie aficionados alike, as the process behind it remains shrouded in secrecy without studio documentation. Originally part of Paramount Productions in the early 20th century, the film found its way to MC Universal for TV distribution in the late 1950s. Since then, it has become a staple on various channels, finding its place in home collections with DVD releases in the mid-2000s. Turner Classic Movies has also embraced its charm, featuring it regularly for audiences to enjoy. In the 1942 movie, The Palm Beach Story, William Damaris received a posthumous Golden Palm Star on the Palm Springs Walk of Stars at 123 South Palm Canyon Drive in Palm Springs, California on April 9, 1998. With roles tailored to their talents, the actors needed little direction, creating a relaxed set where they felt comfortable trying anything the script demanded. When he had to fall down a flight of stairs, Joel McCrea received a demonstration from Preston Sturges, who took the fall first to show it was safe. McCrea's biography can be found in the Scribner Encyclopedia of American Lives. In the making of the Palm Beach story, Preston Sturges faced challenges with Mary Astor, who struggled with his brand of comedy. She later admitted it wasn't her forte, unable to mimic the speech patterns he envisioned for high society women. William Damaris, known for his role in the 1945 radio show The Eddie Bracken Story, was one of the co-stars. Monty Blue, another actor in the film, had a difficult upbringing, raised in a home for orphans after his father's death in a car accident when he was eight. His father, a Civil War veteran and former scout for Buffalo Bill Cody, left his mother struggling to raise Monty and his siblings alone. Monty Blue, of Cherokee descent according to the Okmul G Times, faced a typecasting challenge due to the portrayal of Indians as villains. Joel McCrea, grandson of a Western stagecoach driver, was deeply rooted in outdoor pursuits and successful ranching. Frank Fallon, appearing in notable films like Gone with the Wind and The Lost Weekend, had a prolific career spanning several Oscar-winning movies. These actors contributed their unique talents to the Palm Beach story, enriching its narrative with their diverse backgrounds and experiences, adding depth to the film's characters. Picture this a movie where a rich guy's boat is more than just a boat. It's a clever nod to a big shot oil tycoon. That's what you get with the Earl King, the yacht from a film that premiered in England during wartime, giving folks a much needed break from all the gloomy news. And get this, the guy who played Ernie the taxi driver in It's a Wonderful Life might have inspired a Muppet's name on Sesame Street. Pretty cool, right? The Palm Beach story isn't just any old movie. It's got sharp jokes, lively characters, and jokes that never get old. Even though it came out ages ago, it's still making its mark on how we see movies and TV today. That's the power of a good story everyone remembers it, even years down the line. So next time you watch an old flick or sing along with your favorite puppet, remember, they might be connected in more ways than you'd think. 
Victor Podal, known for his work in various roles in the sound era, contributed significantly to the Palm Beach story. Podal served as the dialogue director for The Big Chance and wrote the story for Inside Information in 1934. He also provided continuity and dialogue for Million Dollar Hall in 1935 and the screenplay for Hot Off the Press. Claudette Colbert, a prominent figure in Hollywood, starred in several Oscar Best Picture nominees, including The Smiling Lieutenant, It Happened One Night, Imitation of Life, Cleopatra, and Since You Went Away. Notably, It Happened One Night emerged as the sole winner among these nominations. Despite script alterations, concerns persisted regarding the portrayal of marriage and divorce in the Palm Beach story, as well as the resemblance between the character John D. Hackensacker Roman III and American industrialist John D. Rockefeller. The filmmakers addressed some of these concerns by modifying suggestive lines and reducing the number of unsuccessful marriages attributed to Princess Maud from eight to three plus two annulments. In the wake of a tragic loss in the film industry, a notable actress stepped into a leading role, bringing fresh energy to the production. This change also meant another actress took charge in a separate movie. The new lead actress had previously won a top award for her role in a popular film. During a significant period for movies, a radio adaptation of the film aired, featuring the original actors. This adaptation allowed the story to reach audiences in a different way, keeping its allure alive even beyond the theaters. In short, a sad event led to a big change in the movie's cast, giving a chance for a seasoned actress to shine. The film also found its way onto radio, ensuring its story continued to engage listeners. In the past, two actresses worked together in a film called Midnight, where they portrayed characters facing a tough choice between love and money. One of them played a classy socialite, while the other was caught in a dilemma. This collaboration left a strong impression on viewers because of their acting skills and how well they worked together. After the success of Midnight, one of the actresses had to make a big decision about her career. She was offered a chance to act and direct in a movie by RKO, but decided against it. Instead, she wanted to focus only on acting. This decision came after her performance in another film called The Secret Fury in 1950, which showed how good she was at playing different kinds of characters. Apart from working with the other actress, she also starred in three movies with another actor. These movies range from romantic comedies to more serious ones, showing how talented she was in different genres. Their on-screen chemistry made these films memorable and enjoyable to watch. Throughout her career, this actress had a special way of keeping audiences interested. Whether she was showing the ups and downs of love or playing memorable characters, she always kept people entertained. Even though the Palm Beach story was just one part of her career, it still has an impact today. This actress left behind a body of work that continues to inspire others in the movie industry.